Hey everyone, welcome to Ben's Experience. In this video, I will show you how to create a subdomain in Bluehost. I'm now inside my Bluehost account and to create a subdomain, simply go to websites. Then click on settings under the website you want to create a subdomain for. Click on advanced and scroll down to cPanel. Next to it, click on Manage in order to access your cPanel. By the way, you can get access to my university for free where you can get many courses to help you with your online business. Right now, my courses include a course about Bluehost where you can learn many things including how to set up your website on Bluehost, how to manage your email account, domain name, optimize performance, and also other things like billing and account management. To get access to my university for free today, just go to university.bainsexperience.com, link in the description. Let's go back to our tutorial. Now that you're inside your cPanel, scroll down to domains and click on domains. Click on this create a new domain button. Now, fill in your subdomain, for example, blog.bensestingdomain.com. Here, you can specify the folder name that will contain all of your website files. After that, click on Submit. As you see, my subdomain was created successfully. Let's give it a visit. This is it. Click on this icon. If you see a DNS error like this one, this means that all you need to do is to just keep waiting for your DNS or name servers to take effect. Sometimes it takes just 5 minutes and it can take up to 2 days in some cases. Quick update after just around 15 minutes and also restarting my internet router in order to get a new IP address. I noticed that my new subdomain was added to my website's page. This is it, blog.bainstestingdomain.com. Let's view it live. And now it started showing this forbidden uh, error page. This means that the DNS uh, changes finally took effect after just 15 minutes. Don't forget to give this video a like and also leave a comment below. Thank you.